Hello again. It's been a little while since we've been on this Palmetto Pod. It's been a, a busy, busy, busy summer, but it's been a good thing. Welcome back, y'all. We're happy to be here. My wonderful co-host, Mr. Barry Hicks. Hey, hey, hey. I'm back. <laughs> and with a bad lip, too, oh, man. Oh, my God. Yes. Man, let me tell you. I want to tell everybody this, man, this is no joke. If you go out in the sun, man, you better make sure you have got sunscreen or wrap a cloth around your lip because you do not want to walk around like this. This ain't no joke, man. It hurts. Aquaphor, Abreva, Carmex. Man, that's just a list of few, man. But <laughs> make sure you cover your lips, man. God, this thing is gonna go live, huh? Yeah, we. <laughs> hey, it's been a while, so we were like, man, we might as well be like straight, straight up, just freestyling today, man. Freestyling. Which beach did you go to? You went to Edisto. Edisto, man, I love. It's Edisto. like one of my favorite beaches. Next up, <clears throat> Isle of Palms. I love Isle of Palms. That's that's my go to place. But Edisto ranks in at number two for me. Oh, yeah, man. Nice and quiet where I can read things like Dr. Joe DePenza, these things on the beach. Dr. Seuss. Or Dr. Seuss. <laughs> Y'all, so um, it's August. It's August 1st, matter of fact. And <laughs> <laughs> it's August. August, tax free weekend, y'all. This weekend, the second through the fourth, kids are back in action, getting ready for the upcoming school term. So you might uh, have a chance to save a little bit money on some of those essentials um, <clears throat> over the weekend. Uh, during this sale, uh, I'm, I'm not exactly sure exactly what's all on sale. I know school supplies, school shoes. Supplies. Hey, if you're going to buy a laptop, clothes. if you're going to buy a computer. Is laptops on? Is, oh, yes, sir. It's on there. Okay. If you want to know the for sure list of what is going to be tax free, um, go check out dor.sc.gov um, backslash tax free weekend. You can get a little more details on what that list looks like because I know it's not exclusive to everything. Don't go buy a new dishwasher and be like it's tax free weekend. Yeah, somebody will do it. Yeah, you can't use that. You can't do that. You can't use that in school, man. Don't do that. Also, I'm um, skipping a little over. Uh, uh, the music stuff that we're going to talk about here in just a second on Sunday, because it's relevant to what we're talking about now, there is a festival going on called the First Day Festival 2019 at Segra Park, uh, formerly known as uh, Spirit Communication Park, where the Fireflies play. And it says, this is the description, reading it verbatim, First Day Festival is a completely free event for parents and students, the city of Columbia, surrounding areas. First Day Festival mission is to reduce the burden of not reduce the burden of parents. <laughs> reduce the, reduce burden. the burden that parents have from buying school supplies for their children, including all grade levels. So y'all go check that out. There's going to be some um, some really cool uh, vendors there and also a lot of festival act, uh, activities, uh, including arts and crafts, uh, face painting, free haircuts, free haircuts for girls too. They made sure to make sure it's at girls as well. Uh, resources and information for community vendors. Free healthcare screenings, vision tests, uh, free kids finger painting, and my favorite, my kids' favorite, the big old zone equipped with bounce houses and much, much more. Y'all go check it out. I wish I could go in one. I think that'd be great. Like have an adult, like an adult bounce house, you know, or like a. I know, I know. There's like, y'all, you know, if y'all don't know, Nick is scared of pooty. I wish, I wish we had a way to. To zoom up on this dog. This dog. That's my boy. He's, he's got to wear a diaper, but that's my boy. Pooty poo. All right. Carry on. Pooty's like a little pirate, but he's iconic for the for the lefty fans. So. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> he goes, he's an OG. He's a triple, triple OG. Anyway, free free tax weekend, y'all. So go check that out. Go get the stuff for the kids. Um, Go get those new shoes that my parents always didn't. Seemed to get me. Did you wear Bubba? No, no. I, I, I wore, sh- I wore, I wore, you know, th- I got shoes. It just, they never seemed to be exactly what I wanted to actually get. I mean, so you were kind of like, it's like Little House on the Prairie. Hey, Paul, we get one pair of shoes a year. And did they like, did your dad tap the nails in the bottom of them to keep your soles on? 
He took a pail with a cloth over it. That was his. That was his lunch bag. For those of y'all who are listening out there, <clears throat> my upbringing was very much not like Little House on the Prairie. <laughs> <laughs> his dad was not Michael Landon. <laughs> he wasn't. Mine was uh, I was from Eastover, so yeah, we right we walked to school up. I grew I did grow up in Red Bank though, right? So Woo! Red you lived to tell about it too. Red Bank, get a lot of us. Hey, shout out and much love to all those people out there in the in, in the Red Bank there in the Red Bank area. It's like my E Town Eastover baby. That's right, Mr. That's Bunky's right. in the house. That's right. It's time to talk a little bit of music. Mm-hmm. Let's see, is there a button for that? Yes. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Today, August 1st, what's going on tonight? The Hanger and Hunt. The, I, always, I, always, I always mess it up. The Hanger at Hunter Gatherer. Located at uh, 1402 Jim Hamilton Boulevard, Columbia. Uh, Punctual Troubadour is going to be there, which is a folk bluegrass band that will be playing. All night long for y'all to enjoy the Palmetto Summer's Night. Go check that out. Also, tonight at Pearl's Upstairs is a jazz party with music from Robert Gardner. So, another thing to check out. Usually don't have a whole lot of live music on um, Thursdays. So, kind of neat that there's a couple of places pushing out some music on Thursdays. Full show. Right. Moving on into Friday, 7-Eleven Saluda Avenue. That's our friends down there at the White Mule in Five Points. They have two acts coming to you, kicking off at 7 p.m. with possible side effects. And for you late night dwellers, starting at 10 p.m. is the Cletus Baltimore. It's $10 at the door. Y'all go check it out. And following also on Friday, which brings me back to my childhood a little bit right here, right? You remember all the... the I'm loving that button today. <laughs> the the <clears throat> I can remember when we were when I was little, we always had lots and lots of like Fenway or Fenway Finley Park, uh, you know, events, concerts and stuff. You yeah. know, you go out there, you bring the chairs, and you just kind of rock and roll as a kid the whole. Oh night, yeah. So did you ever go when they had like the Root Doctors down there back in the day? I'm not gonna say Walter. I'm not gonna say that I was there. <laughs> No, man, I can remember back in the day at Finley Park. That I, used to be a thing. Oh, yeah. You well, know, you, you got the playground there. You had the, the big old waterfall. You and know, you got where hobos probably pooped around the waterfall. You had that, too. Just saying. Surprise. Anyway, it's nice to know that um, if you are looking for that family night, bring some chairs and some blankets out there um, to Finley Park. And also, uh, Ice House Amphitheater is also doing something located at a uh, 107 West Main Street in Lexington. They're showing, they're showing Casablanca. Really? <laughs> yeah. Wow. I thought it would be like the Water Boy or Wedding Singer, Adam Samuel. Casablanca. It's a, it's a PG. It's a PG movie. So you know, sit back and enjoy all that good. Oh, stuff. we hadn't gotten to talk about it. What about the new season of Stranger Things? Is there any? Raise your hand. Uh, you can't. I'm a stranger. I'm a Stranger Things fan. Better oh yet, God, me and my wife. Man. Yeah, I don't watch a lot of TV, but if I find that TV show that really captivates me, I, I binge just like the rest of you on Netflix, and I binged. I mean, I spent a whole Saturday watching. It's so it good, season. man. It's so good, man. Another show, <laughs> if you are a sports fan, or even if you're not a sports fan, it is a show. That, I mean, it's, it's cool, but um, Last Chance You, about um, the first two seasons were – School in East Mississippi, and the second two are Kansas, in the middle of Kansas, but the the school. And this chance is like these kids that went to you know your top schools and played football and got in trouble, you know. Oh but, yeah, yeah, you were telling me about yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, and but to where watching the show, man, to watch these kids, you know, some of them have a good comeback, some of them don't, but to show like the the academics and the people, you know, the teachers and stuff at the school that are truly out there fighting for these kids and helping them out and stuff. It's awesome, man. It's a great show. And it's got a lot of reality, like, in your face. In your face. Saturday, August 3rd, moving on into your Saturday. If you happen to like that live music, you like a nice, intimate, close setting, uh, and you're looking for uh, a local vibe, stop by Foxfield Bar and Grill located at... 406 Howard Street in the heart of Gamecock Country for your entertainment. 
They have Grateful for the Dead, a Grateful Dead tribute, and they will be making you groove with the iconic catalog of Jerry Garcia and the boys. Also, before we even get to birthdays, happy birthday, Sir Jerry Garcia. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Um, another tribute. There's, this is like a tribute Saturday kind of in a way. Uh, going on over there, if you move a little closer to the river, uh, the Senate Columbia, located at 1022 Senate Street, is Stardust and Ashes, a tribute to the late, great David Bowie, and that's going to start at 7 p.m. So, oh, that's cool. It's probably going to be a pretty cool show, if they're as theatrical as Bowie is. Anyway, I, yeah, you, you got know, to be. I'm not saying he's going to be Bowie. I'm just saying, if you can impersonate it, you'll probably still get a pretty good show. So, go check that out. Go check that that's out. A, that's, that's some big shoes to fill, man. I didn't even tell you who was playing at uh, at Finley. Uh, Tony Terry, that's his name. Uh, he'll be playing out there. It's going to be a, a, a jazz deal, whatnot. Don't bring any alcohol. They're not letting alcohol in here or whatnot, but it's for all ages. Bring your lawn chairs, no pets, um, and there's going to be food vendors. So go check that out just to recap that real quick. All right. So it's been a crazy month, like I'm told you it's been a, it's been a wild month but it's been a good month um as far as july june and july really june and july the summertime has been good okay the market's doing well right now south carolina's housing market's doing well i work for guild mortgage company i'm a lender i love doing what i do i love putting people in homes this handsome young man right here works for exit real estate and he will put you in a house to find the perfect thing for you so if you're watching this if you know friends family People, you know, co-workers, and they're looking for a house, I ask that you please send them our way because I'm, we're just really good at what we do. And, and we like to have a good time while we do it. We do, and we love helping people. Y'all can visit the link that we're going to put below this podcast um, if you want to reach out to Barry for real estate needs. And if you are looking for financing, I will also put my online application where you can knock it out in about six minutes and be done with it. Oh, don't count it. Sorry, man. <laughs> I think he... Got him! Wait, 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 wait. Got him! Nope. <laughs> that was such a weird cue to do that. Wait, don't go it. Where's it at? Wait. That would have been... Nope. I've hit everyone except for... That's what she said. <laughs> he said... He said to knock it out. And wait a second, here we go. This is... That's a... what she said. <laughs> <laughs> yes! It's supposed to be a PG type of show. <laughs> Hide your kids. Hide your wife. <laughs> so, anyway, like I was saying, if, if you are looking to get into a home, if you're looking for financing, if you are, if you know that you need some type of credit restoration, I'll be the first one to tell you I'm not a credit restoration person, but I do know a few people that are doing some really great things, and fortunately to their service, they've helped people get into homes. Um, so, Please reach out to us. This is what we like to do, okay? Oh, uh, it's birthday time. Birthday. Man, man, man. Let me start off with mine. All right, man. All right. This is from, yes, I'm starting with yesterday. Debbie Foster. That's Jay. The plays with Lefty, his mother. Miss Foster, happy birthday. Gail Hare. John Appleseed. Russell Stringer. Eric Corcoran. Jason Tucker. Jason Cooper. David Wilson. Lori Fold. Clayton. Elizabeth Harkins, Chris, Melanie Payne, Thrower, uh, Aunt Penn Warden, Aunt, love you, man, um, Shannon Harris, Megan Turner, my Aunt Diane Budden, uh, Thomas Garvin, Heather, Heather Altry, love you, girl, and wait, wait, and these are today, and I'm, I'm going to be done, I'm sorry, guys, I'm, but and, uh, another one of my cousins, Melanie, happy birthday, love you, one of my longtime friends, Angela Poteet, happy birthday, Another longtime friend, Rita Warren, happy birthday. Happy birthday. James Scoggins, Callahan, Patrick William, Ray, man, I'm going to screw that name up, Alzola, Michelle Scoggins Fitzgerald, Leslie Dominic, and I believe you, you're you in here like, you've got like three probably Facebook accounts, but Michelle Scoggins. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Fitzgerald, and... and Kenneth Durden and Scotty Seeger, Ed Black, and last but not least, my homeboy Robbie Brazo. <laughs> 
Happy birthday to all those people. And I, I want to give a, a big, big shout out to someone that is near and dear to, I'm sure, all of our hearts. Um, Santa Claus! It is it is rapper Coolio's birthday. Coolio's 55 <laughs> years old today. Obviously, we said it's Jerry Garcia's birthday. Happy birthday to Jerry. And moving on into the people that I actually know or at least have found their way onto my Facebook. Happy birthday today to Rachel Hare, Jamal Castrill, uh, Savannah Blackwell, and Jenny Yu. Also, there's been a few people that had a birthday yesterday. Big shout out to Doug Falcon. Doug and I write songs together. He is from Canada. Amazing, amazing, amazing songwriter. Hey. Love you, brother. Yeah. <laughs> Love you, eh? Um, Let's see, Tracy Madison, Amanda Ball, Allison Bopp, K.K. Moore, uh, Vanessa Anderson, Lauren Wilds, uh, Rachel Long, Tiffany Barwick, uh, Tanya Taylor, Tanya, big shout out to you, Peaches Holmes, Stan Branham, Kimberly Smith, Lindsey Steed, uh, let's see, Deshaun Wright, Taryn Wheeler, happy birthday, Taryn, uh, Steve Borden, Faith Blankenship, Amber Rankin, that's Scott Rankin from Kenny George Band's wife. Oh, really? Yep, so she, she is cool by default. Cool. Nate Ripka and Trey Patterson. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Anyway, we just wanted to show a little bit of love today, y'all. That's a little bit of what's going on around here. Happy birthday to all the people on here, especially Coolio. Okay. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We're going to see you soon. I promise it won't be as long next time. But until then, y'all stay cool. We'll see you soon. Keep it classy. And protect your lips. <laughs>